and welcome back to episode 40 of Ragecraft 3. I'm your host, Rock. Rock with the most. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Alright, we're back with another episode of Ragecraft. We have finally made it to Intersection 4, and we are ready to progress our way into it. As you can see, we have a lovely new set of armor. The OP, ridiculous, epic Zin's armor set. Unbreakable prot, high, high prot. Um, this one's a little bit sketchy, but we'll see how it does for us. But high protected, unbreakable armor. Oh boy, am I excited. <laughs> and actually, I think, yeah, one of the pieces gives extra damage too, which is also always nice. So yeah, we are moving into intersection four. Uh, we have a few areas to go. A few areas to go. Elysian Labs, Reeking River, Fort, Vis Visceron, and the Exile. Elysian Labs. Which one is... The oh, Elysian Labs should be the brown, right? Uh, that looks like black. This looks like brown. This is the Elysian Labs. This is the Elysian Labs. All right. So that is going to be the first area we're going to go into today. However, there is one thing I wanted to do. Uh, before we did that, um, we do have a little bit of underside to this intersection uh, that looks like it might be worth investigating. Um, at least maybe see if we can find anything interesting. Maybe some loot. Maybe some emeralds. Maybe a cookie. Who doesn't like a cookie? Uh, maybe something good. We can hope. Oh, mushroom. Well, this is a mushroom biome, so... Anything down here? Hurrah! Felicia would not just have an underside area that goes to nothing. Let's go over here. This looks like as big of a, as good of a guess as anyway. And I would be wrong. <laughs> Did you not really have anything down here, Felicia? I is a disappointment. There's got to be something around here. Hmm. Uh, maybe there isn't. All right, well, that was a nice, nice friendly waste of time. I right, bet. Bet, buddy. Bet, friend. Now, I bet there is something down here. However, I... In my infinite blindness, probably have missed it. And I'm sure someone will comment going, Oh, Rock, you missed something here at this timestamp. Go correct your mistakes, you fool. <laughs> you fool! At which point I'll fix that in that due time. But it looks like... Oh, God! For the most part, we're not seeing anything down here. Okay. Well, let... Let's work on... Ooh. Hello? No? Stop. Ooh. Work on getting back up. Oh, that looks like a, a viney staircase there. Let's, uh, let's take that. <laughs> that might be better for us. At least we'll, uh, we'll know that we'll be able to get all the way up. Aha! Oh! Partially all the way up. But there are holes. Ah, hell. Let me catch you guys back up there and we'll continue. <laughs> Alright. We're back. That, um... That ain't quite as planned. I, uh, I figured something would have actually been down there. Alright, so let's work our way over to the brown crystal. The Elysium Labs. Um, I'm kind of hoping we find a, uh... Ooh, we just shipped it right off that slab. Ooh. Um, I'm, the big thing that I'm hoping to find is an early emerald. Um, uh, just because we are sitting at eight emeralds at base, uh, finding an early emerald would be fantastic for us. Um, and it would allow us to kind of uh, get our diamonds going soon. Uh, or, yeah, diamonds going soon. Uh, warning, time travel can cause intense nausea and headaches. Oh, boy. Where are you sending us to, Alizio? What kind of hellish... <laughs> hellishness are you trying to put us through? 
assume this is a teleport pad. It has a lovely amount of a... Uh... Ah! Lovely amount of iron, or uh, cold blocks around. Are we in ocean biome? Okay. We got a little bit of torches around here. Is this the teleport back? Back to intersection four. Okay. So brown wall. I'm trying to remember. I don't quite remember if in uh, Ragecraft two, Helicio was uh, the trolley type or not, or whether he took the uh, areas more serious. I was kind of hoping that did something. <laughs> All right, so let's uh, work our way through this area. See what Helicio has in store for us. Hello there, Beacon Bob. Do you drop your beacon head? Is the question. That is disappointing. <laughs> oh, I can hit him. Oh, it's a guardian on his head. All right, the guardian has is visible. Has thorns. Did it drop? No. I was really hoping for a beacon. <laughs> Hello. Oh, you guys are a lot tougher. My uh, super duper sword is not one shotting you. Interesting. Journal one. <clears throat> We have developed a prototype of a mobile 50, 500 million volt elect, electro turret for military applications. I'm sure a lot of people in my position would be tempted to steal the technology to build their private army of unstoppable death machines, but not me. Nope. Never even considered it. Not for a moment. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> he totally considered it. Ah. What are you? You're dead. That's where you are. You're dead. Okay. This is an odd area to say the least. What are you? Dead scientist. And now you are a dead, dead scientist. <laughs> oh, I slay myself. Ow! <laughs> Uh -oh. Ow! You cheeky bastard! All right, so there is a sniper over there. <laughs> uh, oh God, there's a lot of you. Um, okay. This is when um my uh AOE axe would have came in handy. There is apparently a. Um, There's apparently a, uh, oh, what the hell? First off, block that off. Uh, second of all, there is apparently a sun spawner with this that is spawning them hella fast. These dead scientists. God damn! Okay, we need to find out where this is coming from. There. Okay. Let's deal with that. Another one. Okay, there's a sign over there. This is an interesting area, to say the least. Very odd. Very weird. I don't know how to feel. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this. Caution, do not press this button. Oh, boy. Alicia, why do you tempt us so? Oh, God, that scared the... But Jesus! Ow! Jesus! You know what? I don't know what I expected. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know. What, I don't know why. I, what I expected to happen. Um. Well, that was pretty much exactly what I what what should have been expected. <laughs> oh, this area. A nice, nice trolley area. 
And I've got to deal with that guy. There's a chest over there and everything. I'm going down to him. Ow! Ow! No. Adrenaline impo- Adre- Adre- Blah, blah, blah. Adre- blah. God damn! Adre- Adrenaline potions. Interesting. What they do, insta held two, strength, speed two. Oh, that's actually pretty good. We'll grab those. It's actually better than my potion. Barbara! And again, I don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> With the, uh, the the do not press button. He told me not to press it. And I pressed it anyways. There's a bunch of coal there. Uh, that looks like a lovely amount of coal that we are going to want to grab when we get the opportunity. Is there anything else in here that we... No, I think we need to go down. Okay. Luckily, it wasn't that uh, that dastardly of a, an explosion that ca would have caused a uh, death. I don't know why, but I'm starting to feel very uneasy about a lot of this stuff that I'm finding. All right, let's clean up the inventory a little bit. Drop off a few of these things. Grab some of these things. Vulnerability. Good pick. Good helmet. Good pants. Golden apple. Some arrows. Some more arrows. All right. Perfect. 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 <sighs> Still, still, still questioning myself as to what I actually expected. <laughs> he said, "Don't press it." I pressed it. I don't know. I'm, I'm just gonna not question myself. I pressed it for a reason, out of pure principle, and probably a bit of rebellion. Alicia tells me not to do something. I will do it anyways. <laughs> Don't kill yourself. Oh, Alicia, you're putting me in a bind here. I mean, why would you tell me that unless you wanted me to kill myself? Or is that what you wanted me to think? The hell are you? Ah! Ooh. There's a... Oh, iron blocks. And a special item. Static shield. I don't know what that actually does. I think it gave me a little bit more, um, a little bit more, uh, health boost. I am invincible. Oh, God. Oh, no. We're going to run. Okay. Okay, where are you spawning from? You're spawning from somewhere. Somewhere I don't like. Okay. Got another one of these. Oh. Ah, there it is. I feel that this is exactly exactly a troll wall. <laughs> there is a lot to this area that screams troll. Like, do not press this button. At least you can't you can't put that kind of pressure on me. <laughs> The more you tell me not to do it, the more likely that I am to want to push the button. Uh, 
Mechanical pick, 3,000. Woo! Okay. Efficiency, four. Fortune, four. Now fully automated. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Oh, and diamonds. We're getting a nice assortment of uh, goodies here. And XP. Mm hmm. <laughs> Assuming this is not a troll pick. <laughs> nope. It's legit. It's a fast pick. Aw, oh, yeah. Ah! Damn it, Alicio. You can't just play with my emotions like that. You scared me. Of course, your hoppers are going to be trolling me and eating all my iron blocks. <laughs> oh, oh, Helicio. You troll. All right. What's in here? Anything in here? Okay. Fantastic. <laughs> Jokes on you. Knockback resistance. Oh god. All right. Don't get overrun. Slay all the shit. <laughs> the nice thing <laughs> is uh, I believe we have that pass of uh, frenzy. We get a little bit of uh, strength whenever we kill something, if I remember correctly. It's been a while since I've looked at the, the, the list for it. What's this? Oh, it's an elevator. Ladders. Okay. Uh, let's investigate up and around here real quick. Just to make sure there's nothing useful. Uh, 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 uh. Easy enough. Easy enough. I'm waiting for a supercharged creeper to drop down on my face, though, but easy enough. Okay. Kind of looped around. Ooh, what's that? What's this? What's that? Ow! Fire! Ah. Ah. Um, if I remember correctly from the, um, the sign for the area, there are seven emeralds in this area. Um, ow! There are seven emeralds in this area, so we'll have to keep that in mind. We'll do that. Uh, there are seven emeralds in the area, so we are bound to find ourselves an ah! emerald within this area. So hopefully this episode. <laughs> we can hope. Oh, we're getting a lot of iron blocks, too. Hmm. Mm -mm. Um, okay, can I make some space in here to drop off some stuff like this and this? Grab. I don't want that. Prop 4 is good. Torches are good. XP is good. Oh, there's too much to grab. Regen. Sharpness 10. Ah, oh, so good. Okay. We'll go with that. <laughs> and one thing that I'm seeing is a, quite an abundance in this area is coal blocks. So... I'm definitely thinking we're probably going to have to grab some of this coal off screen because our coal supply is starting to run low-ish. Um, I mean, not to a point where we can't make torches or anything like that, but I mean, it's, well, it at least feels low-ish. Um, so let's get to a point where we're probably going to have to uh, start making, getting some more coal blocks. And you know what? There's one thing, one fun thing about having the Zins, uh, the Zins armor, the Zins, uh, yeah, the, the Zins set, is I don't have to worry about its durability. <laughs> it's always going to be just fine. So long as it's on me, it's just fine. Nope. 
I'm actually curious as to what potion this is. Is it a new one, maybe? That would be exciting. A lightning trap. Ooh, that is new. Um, I can't read it. Uh, trap place where the potion hits the ground. This trap is destroyed when one minute has passed or when a new trap the same type is placed. Potion has infinite uses. and not soon. Mobs near the trap are struck by lightning. Hmm. I can picture some good and bad uses of this. <laughs> good use. I hit some mob for lightning. But the lightning doesn't really do a whole lot of damage. But it's a, po a new potion. Hmm. Hmm. My, my inventory is too full. But I want it. But I want it. Oh, this, this gives plus two attack damage. No. Okay, we're going to grab these. All right. And we're definitely going to have to run back to base and uh, deposit some stuff. Or at least um, find a, a safe-ish place to deposit some stuff. I do have a lot of wood on me. Oh, that's the way I need to go. Not that I want to go right now. I do have a lot of wood on me. So we could set up some backup chest somewhere relatively close by, like over here. Seems like a good place because we have to back well have to backtrack through here um oh boy we'll drop you down for now um you we'll set up a couple double chests this is the uh this is the nice thing about carrying carrying logs with you is that it allows you to do stuff like this um throw that down that down this stuff allows us to uh kind of Clean our inventory out a little bit. And then allow us to keep going. <laughs> Which we're going to do right now. All right, back up. We'll go... Um... Oh, there's another one. I don't remember that one being there when we first when we first passed through here. Are they respawning? <laughs> that would be kind of interesting. Respawning uh, iron blocks. All right. Uh... <laughs> Back, uh, back through this area. Let's see where this leads us. Hello. Hello. Oh, boy. Um, we are on the first floor, and we are... We can head up to the third floor. Ooh. All right, well, this area has a lot to it, it seems like. At least by the sounds of that uh, elevator passage. We got a lot to deal with. Am I excited for it? Hell yeah. That just means there's more cool stuff to do. Grab that. And that. <laughs> I feel so trolly. I have to go digging into the hopper just to grab. <gasps> Woo! Holy hell! That Fortune 4. That's no joke. I got 55. 55, 55 lapis off of two blocks. <laughs> lightning trap. I do have a couple potions of lightning, so I'm not too worried about grabbing more. But I'm going to anyways. Why not? We'll have a few extra at base. Not that we're probably ever going to use them, but we'll have a few extra. Um, okay, so I think the next place we're going to have to go is into the elevator. Oh, is there a guy below us? Uh, well, you know, while I'm here. I'll just grab a couple of these. <clears throat> Not hurting anyone. Not hurting anyone at all. The boy... The more I grab them now, the less I have to grab them later. The logic. It's sound. Sound logic. And perfect. Okay. So, best guess is we're probably going to have to head into the elevator. Um, I don't remember seeing much else elsewhere. Um, are you the one that was poking it? Trying to poke the bear. Um, I don't remember much else elsewhere. Who are you? Just a fat spider? Silly fat spider. 
Um, I don't remember seeing much elsewhere. Where are you guys coming from? Just guys I missed? Or did you spawn from somewhere? Okay, obviously you guys spawned somewhere. Okay. Um, I don't remember seeing anything elsewhere that I remember. <laughs> As we know, my memory is terrible. It's a dead end pathway room. Let's just double check. As we know, my memory's terrible. So there's always possibility. Okay, no, this is the way we came up from before. There's always that possibility that there was another way, and I forgot it. Uh, this looks like a dead end. All right, let's go to the elevator. We're going to do stuff with that. Work our way up. Maybe. Work our way up. Let's see what uh, floor two has in store for us. It seems odd that this is how we're supposed to get up. But... Or down, rather. Sometimes you don't question stuff. Have we actually been down there? I'm gonna go down. Ah. Okay, nope, we haven't been down here. Alright. Well, we'll go down here first. <laughs> oh! There's a lot of lightning around. High voltage! Not liking the sound of all that, uh, all that lightning. And all of, oh boy. Nor am I liking the looks of all the blazes. All the blazes, oh, or the fire, oh god. Oh, invisible. Of course you're invisible. You're down here, aren't you? This is where fire resist, not having the fire resist pass. <laughs> Sucks. Ow. However, we have a bucket of water, so I guess it's not all for not. Ah! Okay, those guys have a blaze riding on top of them, which I'm guessing is this. So that is a skeleton mob with a blaze on top. An invisible blaze. Okay. Let's see your game. T taste my fire. <laughs> oh, that's right. Whenever I kill something, I get fire resist. Ha ha. So keep killing stuff. That's how I live. That is how I'm going to live. Okay. So I do see an emerald in the middle of this area. Um, and a ton of pathways around. Okay, the emerald is the kind of the big thing that I want to. Oh boy, lightning. I'm guessing what the station shield is for. <laughs> is the getting a lot of damage from the lightning. Okay. Oh, guardian. Okay. Actually, no, we'll just... Alright, oh god, there's so many... So much lightning around! Mm, mm. This area is something interesting, to say the least. I don't know... I don't know how I feel about it, but it's something interesting. It's definitely a, um, a far departure from uh, what we've been seeing in uh, a lot of the other areas. 
jelly potions. I will grab those, not that. Okay. And definitely a far departure from what we've been seeing in uh, some of the previous areas. Um, it's weird. <laughs> it's weird. Okay, as long as we keep killing stuff, and we hold our sword most of the time, I think we'll be good, because our sword gives knockback resistance. A slowy knockback resistance. Oh god, you guys hurt! I had something fierce! Okay. Ooh. Man, these mobs aren't very fun. <laughs> They're not very friendly. We got this. Snipe him. Get it over with. And then get in here. Block that off so I don't have to deal with holes. Okay. I'm actually really happy that uh, we I ended up getting that um, buff for uh, fire resist on uh, killing mobs. Um, it was a great suggestion. Ah, oh, damn it. Great suggestion. I'm actually glad I followed that suggestion. Key one of six. Shadow key. Mysterious key used to open the black gate. Uh oh. That's another one of those areas I see. Alright, well, we have one of six keys. One of those areas. Okay, this should be interesting. So if that is only the first key that we found, <laughs> that means we have a lot to this area that we have not seen yet. Oh boy, oh boy. A lot to this area we have not seen yet. Okay. Well, let's get over here. Deal with this. Deal with that. And that. Well, if anything, this pick is, allow us, is going to allow us to have lots of lovely, delicious diamonds. Lots, lots of delicious diamonds. <laughs> I mean, out of eight, we got 22. I'd say that's a pretty good, uh, pretty good, pretty good nab. Well, if anything, floor is zero. Well, the basement. Ah! The bottom floor is complete. Let's switch to something that I can run with. I think that's complete. I don't think we had anything else. No, we can go that way. I see a spawner, so that means we haven't gone this way. Hmm. Okay, let's do it this way real quick. Whew. Am I playing a risky game by uh, carrying all this stuff with me? Hell yeah! But would I have it out of any other way? Hell no! We're gonna play that risky game, because you guys are. Stop being so damn loud, Lightning! Path up. Let's go up. Ah! Normal number two. Ow! Well, we're gonna burn a little bit. Okay, nope. Just a little bit. Um, okay. So we got two emeralds. Um, we're gonna have enough to. We already have enough to um, unlock our next emerald block. Man, that lightning is loud, or thunder. Thunder is loud as hell. Is there something to this? I must feel that there's something to this. Well, 
Well, there's something up there, so let's investigate that real quick. Oh, there's the third layer. <laughs> And I gotta say, thank goodness. Thank goodness we don't have to worry about our armor! Uh, because this shit would have been hella broken by now. And we would have died even faster. Why do I feel that there's something in the middle of that? I'll assume that there's nothing in the middle of that for now, but deep down inside. Ah! Deep down inside, I, I'll wonder. <laughs> I'll wonder if there was something in the middle of that. All right, now we've officially cleared out this uh, basement area. We are running at 36 minutes or so right now. What's this? Damn broken elevator. Well, we have the jumps, so we can do that. <laughs> um, oh shit. Okay, so I think yeah, we're running at thirty-six, almost thirty-seven minutes right now. Might be good to call it there. Let's get back up to here, this floor. Figure out how I'm gonna get over here. Oh god, no! Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, I think this is a good time to head back to base. Um, I'm gonna do a quick cut, catch you guys back over at base, and uh, we'll uh, we'll place our new emerald block and uh, get our upgrade and continue from there. So I'll be right back. All yeah, right, so we got our emerald block heading over to the monument. We're actually pretty close to getting all the emerald blocks for the map, which is actually pretty impressive in comparison to uh, what we did before. Punisher level two. Ooh. Sharpness ten, smite three, fire spec knockback two, unbreakable. Ooh, that's actually quite good. Um, now not as good as a cryo slasher, <laughs> but still good. Still good. Um, let's head back over to here. Upgrade our scavenger buff too, and we are good to start raking in the diamonds. Realistically, not that we'll use them. Actually, would it be would it be good to grab that? I mean. We can't repair, or at least we're choosing not to repair at the moment. So it might be good to switch to something else. Um, or we can just go with the diamonds. Um, I would presumably guess that there might be trading, maybe? Let's do this. We'll just take a peek at some of these books real quick. See what they lead to. After not taking damage. Okay, no, we're not doing that. Divine Shield 2 was refreshes every 40 seconds. Not worried about that. Frenzy, I don't think was anything special. Chances, you have a 65% chance to gain strength 2 after killing a mob. So, so. Tainted Arrows was definitely one that was interesting. Um, but so, so. Okay, never mind. Scavenging is the only decent one here. And it doesn't hurt to have the extra diamonds. Um, presumably, I, uh, you'll find a trader or something that uh, trades for diamonds. Much like we've found traders that traded for gold and iron and such. Um, whether this actually becomes the case or not is a different story, but we can presume. Presumptions are the key to everything. <laughs> Alright, but that is going to do it for today, everyone. Thanks for joining, as always. Um... Let's make a little I'm put my item frames in here. Uh, let's make a little spot for our Punisher. Uh, we'll put it right up here. And we'll throw that in there for now because we're not going to use it just yet. But it's nice to have. 
But that is going to do it for today, everyone. Thanks for joining as always with another episode of Ragecraft 3. And I will catch you all next time. All you lovely gals and guys. Bye.